So my fucking coat is in police custody? At the moment, yes. My coat has been arrested. Dear 16, 8, 16 a.m. Most of the housemates are asleep. Tracy, Maggot and Ruler face eviction later today. Preston, Michael and Pete are in the kitchen. I can't bear the voice today. I can't bear it. My voice? Ruler's voice. That's the frame of mind you've woken up with now. Mm -hmm. It is. It's too stuck in my head. <laughs> He's going through one of his phases. Anti-ruler phase. For Christ's sake, really, do not come out now. <coughs> and that's just a disgusting thing. <coughs> that's what's on your picture, filth and depravity. Peter's picture, puppy killer. <laughs> <laughs> puppy killer. You know, she's got a croak in her voice. Mm. You know him, Lulu. Rulu. Rulu. <laughs> Zulu. Did you have a lighter, darling? Uh, disappears. You all have one. You had one earlier when you in came your, in. Yeah, in your makeup bag. I went through your makeup bag looking for. I the... saw you. You had one. I went through your makeup Is bag looking for the fountain parents? of youth, darling. You know you had one. Is that your lighter? Huh? Fuck off, Radhead. Um, hello, big brother. <laughs> Can we have a quick chorus of ging ga gu 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 Come on, join in, everyone. Sing along and I And all you young ones who trend in the hip rappers. <laughs> 11.43 a.m. Chantel, Ruler and Michael are in the bedroom. Best if you move the stuff off the floor first, darling. Huh? It'd best if you move the stuff off the floor first. Oh, I've only got 20 minutes, though. Preston is in the diary room. I just, I just think everyone's going to nominate me now because... They've seen what happens, do you know what I mean? They've seen what otherwise has been hidden from view. You know, they've seen what goes on in here. And they know what goes on in here, but to see it on, on a screen like that, you just, it, it can't help but make people think bad about you, but... Because it is kind of like a family, the way we're all living together and, and, and you know, 24 hours a day and everything. And because me and Chantel are younger, I feel really like we're just little kids now. The relationship I have with Pete is so bizarre. Because I really, I like him and I really respect him. And I think he's intelligent and I think he's, I think he's really cool and everything. But he, he's like, a, he just is so com like completely inappropriate the whole time. And it's funny, but like, it's just, you know, it gets a bit much sometimes. Like, he, he makes these, like, flirtatious comments to me or whatever. But he only does it to do my edit, you know what I mean? I don't know, it, this house would be, you know, infinitely worse without him. 12.03 p.m. Chantel, Preston, Michael and Ruler are in the kitchen. Michael has been tidying the house for 61 minutes. Michael... <laughs> Look how obsessive compulsive you've done the chairs. Hi. Right? You've just done the chairs in total obsessive compulsive line. Yeah. No, it's getting worse, isn't it? Is it a sign of stress? Stress you're stressed out? Or is it just slant boredom? No, I like straight lines. You're not bothered. If I do this, it doesn't. Pete, Maggot and Tracy are in the bedroom. What colour are your towels, Pete? Brown. Brown what? What brown? Rusty brown, they're by there. No, no, they're mine. No, I got rusty brown last night. And your dark, your dark blue? Let's keep calm, as long as 
we've got enough sets of towels, we're fine. Yeah. Well, we must be short somewhere. Somebody's used two lots of towels. Joe, say a guy. Thanks, sweetie. Mm -hmm. I'm a bit worried, actually, because the look on his face has changed. It's sort of slightly... Well, when, uh, when, you know, when we had this mix-up over the towels, Eddie, it, it looked as if he might, with the uh, Pete, he He's might very flare nervous. up. Oh, I didn't realise. But honestly, when I came out early this morning, everything was in little lines and oh, kept really? readjusting so all the, you know, the, the names were facing the right way. No, I didn't know condition. that. I didn't even notice. What, have you just noticed, or you actually... No, 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 I mean, it's... I think it's over the last 24 hours, the last couple of days. got more and more busy. But it's because it's the, the final straight, final in straight, it. Yeah. Do you look, look, he's folding again, look. No, he just has to keep moving all the time. I think he's just busy himself, busy in himself. But that, no, but that is part of... I mean, look at the chairs over there. Yeah, I know. It's, it's not practical for them to be like that anyway, because you'd just be sitting next to someone. But everything <laughs> has to be in a row. He told me about that earlier. That yeah, he told me about that. Tidies the cupboards, again. everything yeah. has to be, you know, the handles have to be placed oh, yeah, in we'll the same way. Yeah, we'll notice when I put the beams in that in there, he said, can I, if the label's showing. But then that's, that is practical though, isn't it? Because when you open the cupboard, you've got to start fiddling yeah, about. Yeah, but there's a difference between practical and obsessive. Yeah. Mm. You know, now I really feel um, that much as I did in the kitchen in the beginning, that's what keeps him level now. I think that's the way, and the fact that he now doesn't sleep longer than maximum say. two hours at a stretch, he's up all the time. I find eye contact difficult with him now. Really? Yeah, he's, his eyes wander. Yeah, maybe you're, maybe you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Twelve forty one PM. Pete is in the bedroom. Oh well, evictions tonight. I tell you. No, you know it's like out of, the, out of those people. It's Ruler, Tracy, and Maga. Oh. Oh, I can't wait. I hope, well, I know who I hope goes. <laughs> you don't care, right? Or oh, two out of three. There's one I hope stays. George, Ruler, Chantel and Preston are in the kitchen. Oh, Pete's actually tidying up his stuff. Yeah, What's well, happening? He's packing, isn't he? Packing? He's not Unpacking. even nominated. Unpacking. 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 On day two, Pete told Ruler that one of his coats was made of gorilla fur. Two days ago, this coat was removed from the Big Brother house and handed to the police. So far, Pete has not noticed that the coat is missing. What's that gorilla coat? You took it back? What, hon? The gorilla coat. What? The coat. <clears throat> oh, uh, oh, where is it? I just noticed, I swear to God, I just noticed, like, where's that coat? <laughs> uh, that's a bit weird. I swear to God, I said, where's that coat? I swear to God, I thought you took it and put it in your bag. No. Because you would, because when you was nominated, you had that coat on. Hmm. Did you pack the gorilla coat? The other day, did the gorilla coat go in the suitcase? Yes, it was right at the bottom. It's not in there. I see right there. at the bottom of one side. OK, hold on. Is it not there? No. It's rather unusual. I'll just check with that. Have you, t have you checked the suitcase again? The suitcase is not there now. Nothing. Thanks, Dana. I just noticed that's a word. I put it right at the very okay, bottom on. of one side. Okay. Conspiracy. <laughs> Conspiracy. <laughs> Thanks, Take Dennis. All. Take it all. <laughs> that's not that's funny. Take it all. <sighs> Hi, big brother. Hello, Pete. My gorilla fur coat is missing from my suitcase. It was packed by ruler. And uh, Dennis has just noticed it's not amongst my luggage or anywhere in the bedroom. Pete, Big Brother can assure you the coat isn't safe hands. It's not 
in my hands and I want